Hi, I'm Leif Johansson. For my creative supplement for my application to the University of Rochester, I decided to combine a few different things that I enjoy doing and make a video of just some of what I've done in 2015. At my high school this past year, I became president of a broadcasting club in our brand new movie studio. Every week, I worked with other students to produce a news broadcast that was uploaded to the internet. This allowed for the whole school district to stay up to date on the latest from my high school in Sullivan County, New York. Board of Education meeting in the library beginning at 7 p.m. On Friday, December 18th, it's Casual Fair Cause Day at the high school, so teachers don't forget to dress down and support the WSUT and SRP Scholarship Fund at the high school. Up next, let's have a look at the sports news for the week. On Monday the 14th, JV and Varsity Boys Basketball will go up against Tri-Valley in a home game. The JV game starts at 5.30 and the Varsity game is at 7. And on December 18th, there is a Varsity Girls Basketball game against Livingston Manor at 5.30 at the high school, so come out and support the teams. I also found success in singing and playing music at school this past year, such as when I received an A-plus on my Level 6 All-State NISMA solo, when I went to Area All-State, or when I performed at our annual Senior High Choir Cabaret. Fly me to the moon, let me play among the stars, let me see what spring is like on Jupiter and Mars. In other words, hold my hand, but ba 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 da. In other words. when I played drum set for our senior high jazz band concert. Also in 2015, I continue to participate in drama and musical productions as I have been for the last six years now. In March, I played the role of Ben Weatherstaff in the musical The Secret Garden. I would never gotten to play an old guy before. It was different. Walking across the stage as an elderly man was kind of like pretending to quietly walk away after having just tossed myself down a flight of stairs. Later in 2015, I had another theatrical role as an older man when I played Mr. White in the drama The Monkey's Paw. Now that was fun! It combined elements of colloquial 19th century England, the heartbreaking tragedy, and zombies. Doesn't get much better than that. Outside of school, I had the pleasure of doing some other fun theater work as well. 
Between January and August, I played the lead role in a traveling performance called The Weather Project by the North American Cultural Laboratory. We performed across a few states and in all sorts of venues. I think my favorite performance was the one that we did in Brooklyn, just because I'd never gotten to perform in New York City before. But the pictures here are from a few months later at an outdoor performance in Pennsylvania. So besides dramatic works, I also expanded my horizons in journalism this past year with my work at a local newspaper entitled Manor Inc., named after the village of Livingston Manor in which I live. I continued to publish articles and be the webmaster for the newspaper as I have for the past few years now, but I also had some pretty unique experiences this past year, such as when I interviewed Mark Ruffalo in August. That was awesome. I also had my first full year as the director of a group called the Youth Radio Project at a local public radio station in 2015, which was both lots of fun and an interesting learning experience. Unfortunately, you can't really see radio, so rather than watching a clip of our broadcast on here, you can tune it online, and I'll add a link to that in my description of this video. When I wasn't doing theater or making radio or publishing a newspaper, I spent the summer of 2015 working as a colonial blacksmith in a living history museum, and on my days off, I became acquainted with politics as an intern at a New York State Assemblywoman's office. So all in all, 2015 has been an awesome year filled with lots of great things. Oh, and I almost forgot, all of the music that's been playing in the background of this video is off of an album that I composed. Anyway, thanks for watching, and here's to another successful year filled with new opportunities and possibilities.